Hey guys, German Jacobus here. A new welcome, for not new welcome back. It's lovely seeing your beautiful faces. And this is all about my food adventures over the world. And today, we're not on a food adventure. We're in a little car adventure. I've been invited to Nashville to try out the new Ford Maverick, which is right off my shoulder there. Uh, their new, super sweet, cool uh, pickup truck. And this is gonna be a new kind of video for me. Uh, I wouldn't say it's a car review. I'm not a car reviewer, but I do love cars and I'm passionate about them. And the opportunity to get a first look at a car is super cool. So here's what's gonna happen in this video. We're gonna get a few of these bad boys. Ford has provided different models and different trims and different powertrains and all that fun stuff uh, to drive around Nashville, check out, do some cool stuff. Um, yeah, and that'll sort of give you my, I would call it first impressions of the car. I think that's the best best way to phrase it. And yeah, just kind of have some fun and try and, you know, channel my, uh, channel my inner Doug DeMuro and MKBHD and Donut Media, all the food people that I love, the car people that I love watching on YouTube. And don't worry, there are lots of food videos coming from Nashville as well. Uh, I'll link those everywhere. But this one will be more dedicated just to the Maverick. So why don't we get in, start driving. Okay, so let's get some details out of the way about the Maverick first. It actually starts under 20K and comes standard with a hybrid engine that gets 40 miles per gallon in the city. Speaking of the city, it's definitely built for city use as it's based more on Ford's small SUV platform, but as we'll see later in the video, it can definitely handle itself as a pickup truck too. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is take the car on a little bit of a road trip. They have mapped out, that's the wrong thing. They've mapped out, some have mapped out something for me. Hold on, they've mapped out this route for me which should take me on some very scenic routes around Nashville. Maybe take some photos and just get a feel for the car. Uh, I'm gonna switch halfway through. They gave me the hybrid first to drive in this like kind of bluish, steelish, greenish color. It looks cool. And I just wanna get driving. I love driving, especially driving new cars. And I'm excited to feel what this bad boy's got. Okay, so I've been driving and I pulled over because I've been driving along the Natchez Trace Parkway. <laughs> it is stunning, like absolutely stunning. You see the bridge over my shoulder there? Just drove over that and it was just one of the most like insanely epic views ever. Uh, <laughs> like I had to slow down because I was like, I just want to, I just want to look, I just want to look, but I got to drive. Um, really sick, crazy. I love it. I kind of wish I was in like a, um, a race car or something but she's been she's been good she's been she's been good so far but just in nature baby it's beautiful out i'll take it okay it is day two and today uh, they've set up a little adventure to see more of like the off-road truck capabilities of the Maverick. Uh, we're out here on a farm somewhere. I don't know. I got into a van and it just took me where I need to go. It's beautiful. It's a lovely morning. And yeah, they have a bunch of little things set up for like off-roading, which seems cool. Uh, payload, just like all the different things you could put in the back also. Just like the full capabilities of the truck. So I'm going to get driving. I'm here to okay, so they set up a little off-road course. Uh, they gave me another new truck behind me that's more built for off-roading. Um, I've never driven off-road before, so I guess let's just hope that like <laughs> I don't. I mean, what's the worst? What's the worst that could happen, right? Oh, about to find out, I guess. All right, we are off-roading for the first time here. God damn. <laughs> All right, this is more terrifying. Oh my God. <laughs> oh fuck. All right. <laughs> Okay, so they set up like a little course that was like, at first it seemed like pretty simple. Just like, oh, a little, like, along this like beautiful little pond. And then there's like this dark turn. 
and I was like, oh God, where are we going? Um, and it was like straight up, super, super narrow, just fucking like giant rocks everywhere. And I was like, oh my God, if I break this car, they're gonna be so mad at me. But like, obviously, they set it up, it's fine. Um, it was exhilarating, it was fun, I loved it. Um, maybe I should be like an off-roading person. I don't know where I would do that in New York City, but it's a thought, it's a thought, it's a thought. Okay, so let's put a little bow onto this video. Um, first of all, thank you for it. Uh, you let me live out my dreams of being a car YouTuber for a few days. I don't know, you guys let me know in the comments how well of a job that I did. But honestly, cars are super passionate about. I used to love them as a kid. I was a little kid that would go around and know every single car ever. Um, so this has been a blast, just being able to drive and experience and have fun with cars, especially, listen, I live in New York City. I don't get to drive ever, so I'll take every opportunity there is to drive. But uh, just to clear up something, because I didn't mention at the top of this video, I didn't have to post this video, I wasn't paid for this video, it was just come and have fun, whatever, so as real of an experience I tried to share with you guys. If you want overall thoughts on the car, I mean listen, it's not for me, <laughs> they admit it's not for me, I mean, listen, I live in New York City, what do I need a pickup truck for, what do I need any car for, truly. Um, but it was a blast getting to drive. It's goddamn built for tough as they would say is it like the most fun car ever to drive no but that's not the point it's built for utilitarian use um i will say for driving it i don't think i've ever even driven a pickup truck before it's pretty low to the ground it feels much more small suv like and i, I believe that's sort of like what it's more based off of more than the bigger four trucks um it's a good drive obviously handled the off-road stuff very well um at least my little experience with it so I don't know, if you're into it, I guess check it out. <laughs> there you go. Uh, what should my rating be? Should I do like a Doug Demuro score? Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know. My, my rating should be cool. I don't know where that falls on the scale of stuff, but I had a fucking blast and hopefully I get to um, drive more cars. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys think. Until next time, more food. Oh, well stick around. There's a ton more videos coming from Nashville of me eating and vlogging and more travel stuff, so make sure you're subscribed for that. It's either up or it's coming up or whatever. I don't know what my edit schedule is going to be. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video.